Hello everyone, welcome once again to another Power BI related tutorial by Team Slidescope. In this part, we are doing real estate housing price analysis. So we are trying to see different factors affecting price of a house. You can see average price of a house in the data set that is given to us is 4.7 million. And you can see we have some filters here. So if we apply, let's say, what is the average price of air conditioned house with basement, yes, with you know, facing main road, furnishing is status, semi furnished and furnished. So then you will be able to see that everything is filtered and now we have this type of graph. These KPIs are helping us in understanding different average values and aggregate values. And we can use this clear all filter to clear. What is meaning of this? Why are we using a scatter plot here? Why are we using a ribbon chart here? And why are we using this type of layout? Everything that is given here will be discussed in this part. How we created the dashboard, how we created the layout. And then after getting exploratory analysis after getting insights we will create a machine learning model in the second one so let's get started with exploratory analysis using power bi 